So this is a tweet from No BS Trades, which I really like. Um, but Stefan, when I saw the this tweet and I saw your email, I was like, ooh, these really go hand in hand together. Now there's a reason why good traders like us avoid sideways price action. There's a reason why 10 minute stock traders and the best traders in the world out there avoid sideways price action. Profits are made from vertical price, price movements, right? Stefan, if we zoom out just a little bit here, my friend, we still haven't cracked over the February 2nd high. And if we zoom out even further, we've been at this price since February 25th of 2022. And if we zoom out even further, this is actually the same price as it was on April 13th, 2021. I mean, just look at this, right? That is a sideways market. That's a bullish market. That's a sideways market. Stefan, my friend, and everyone who's watching, that is the kind of market you want to trade. That's where you get the returns of 173.41%. That is where you, frustratingly, get about negative 18%. And um, when the market's going sideways, it gets a whole lot, hell of a lot harder to trade. So it's all part of the plan, my friend. I can't stress the importance of trading vertical price movements. Momentum is where the opportunities lead to successful trading. And my favorite part of this entire thing right here, flat markets equal drawdowns. Why does a flat market equal drawdowns? Right? To me, a flat market equals drawdowns because if you're getting in and getting right back out and getting in and getting right back out and getting in and getting right back out, look at this. Let's say you got in um, on, let's see, where's everything crossed over? Right here. All right, everything is crossed over on this date, okay? Let's say you got in on the close of that candle. Okay, 4.10.95. You may have felt really good, and then you got out here, because this is the first day closes below the 10. All right, there's a drawdown there. And then you get back in on the first day it closes back above the 10. All right, looking good. And you get out on the first day it gets under the 10. Okay, that's frustrating, but also part of trading. And then you get back in on the first day it goes over the 10. Right? What do you see here? I see choppy, choppy drawdowns ugliness that I don't want to deal with. So you know what I do? Do you know what the best traders in the world do? They wait. They wait for those vertical price movements. And fortunately for us, and Victor knows, fortunately for us, the rules make it really easy to quantify when that happens. And as I like to say, by doing so, it takes the guesswork out of trading. So thank you all so much for coming today. Stefan, thank you for letting me have a, a chat with you and thank you all uh, for participating as well. Have a fantastic day. We'll be right back here tomorrow potentially, potentially with a bullish offensive day. I am looking forward to it. Have a fantastic afternoon. We'll talk soon.